Hi everyone, I am Maria and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be continuing part two of Abzu, the game that I'm loving. And let's start. Oh, I'm already happy <laughs> just being back here with my robot friend again. Hi, hi. Someone was telling me in the comments that if I go up and I speed up my swimming that I can breach. I want to try that. Ah, oh, cool. Cool. Thanks person who told me that in the comment in my the comments in my last video. You all told me that I should play Subnautica and some people were telling me that it's a bit more difficult than this one. So let's see. Uh, I'm planning on doing that, definitely. So many people told me to do it. I'm gonna check Subnautica after I finish this one. Orcas. Orcas are marine mammals, by the way. They're not fish. A lot of people think they're fish, but no, they are marine mammals. Even though they have, you know, a way to distinguish between mam marine mammals and fish is the orientation of their tail. Do you see they have their, um, their tail fin is horizontal and other fish, if all you look at all the other fish, sharks included, they are vertical. In dolphins also have horizontal fins, so all marine mammals have horizontal fins, while fish have vertical fins. I'm just exploring now here, guys, for a while. Barracuda, I believe. I want to meditate. Yeah, there's a meditation shark there. Oh, look at it, it's so pretty. Let's see the name of the sh all the fish around here. Oh. Barracuda, exactly. What's up? What's up, dude? Bicolor parrotfish, I talked about this one in my last video. This guy here with a lot of colors. I wanna know what's the name of this green. That's a trigger fish, that's some kind of trigger fish. The green with the yellow stripes. No, no barracuda again. Fish with yellow stripes, please. Fish, fish with yellow stripes, please. Why is he only showing me barracudas? Yes. Unicorn fish. Ah, oh, yeah, this one I saw also. This looks like a mainframe. <laughs> this fish, the green one, looks like the mainframe. Why not? Can I? The reef trigger fish, these fish are so good. I think the other one is also a trigger fish. But I would like to know. Arcas, of course. Okay, um, let's continue on with the game because I'm super excited to see what comes next. <sighs> Ooh. Ooh, I'm so excited. I think I'm getting better at this, y'all. I think I'm... Definitely getting better with the controls. I think. Oh, 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 what's coming next? Oh, shark. They are, they like. They worship marine creatures and the shark. Wait, is this shark that ate my robot friend like some mystical god of the deep? Hmm, is that why he ate my robot friend? Because my robot friend is actually a traitor. Are you a traitor robot friend? Oh, wow. Oh, cool. I don't know the name of that fish. <laughs> I would love to tell. Hi, shark. I'm gonna tell you right here, I would, oh my, I would love to see a school of fish like this and all the, the, you know, like you see in those documentaries. 
Don't squash me, please. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. It's... And all the sharks are, this happens, you know, like the, the, the sh wherever there's, wherever, no, but sometimes you see when there's th these big schools of fish, you see a lot of different, no, 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 that's a whale. Are you kidding me? No way. <gasps> it's a humpback whale. No, no. <gasps> no. <gasps> it's my favorite animal in the world. Come back. I love, love humpback whales. A show called Ocean. Oh. <gasps> oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Do you hear it? <sighs> I will one day encounter one underwater. Oh my God. I almost feel like I'm there. <laughs> I'm sure I would be much more excited if this was really underwater, but humpback whales are incredible. Like the sounds they make underwater. Well, the, only the males sing, or at least until now, they've only reported the singing whales that scientists have been able to identify. They've all been males, and we're not entirely sure why they sing. I want to see the name of that green fish up there. Oh, that's a, a marlin. Mm -hmm. yeah, no more. I want to see this green fish. Not that one, but thank you. <laughs> Uh, why does it, which, oh, a white, white tip shark. These are pretty harmless sharks. I would love to see these sharks underwater. Harmless to us, I guess some fish have probably a different idea. Gray reef shark, there's no reef here. Let's not dwell too much. Mahi mahi, oh, that's cute. Ah, these fish are, <laughs> okay, oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Interesting. I mean, that's the wilderness. Fish do eat each other. Burr. <laughs> Hello. I'm. Okay, I wanted to go to the blue whale. That's what I'm trying to do with the pumpback whale. I adore you. Okay, right. Let's continue. Otherwise, I'll never finish this game, I think. I think after I finish and share it with you guys, I'm going to redo all of it again just to explore this. Uh, no, what am I doing? Enter to exit. And, uh, so, amazing. Okay, I'm also excited to go to the next the next challenge. <laughs> Ooh. There we go, there we go. <laughs> What's coming next? What's coming next? It's yellow. Up into the sun. <laughs> Why is it yellow? Oh, oh, oh. It's more somber, this soundtrack right now. And there's a chain. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh. This is a kind of an Atlantis, like a, a, a lost kingdom under the ocean. I used to be, well, obsessed is probably the wrong word, but I used to be quite in love with the myth of Atlantis. 
just imagining that there, like, it probably doesn't exist. But I read a lot about it and I watched a Disney movie. Is it Disney? I think it's Disney. I'm not sure. You know, the movie from Atlantis that came out. And I was, I would always imagine myself exploring the depths of the ocean and finding Atlantis. <laughs> That's probably not going to happen. But this is like, this is kind of like uh, a proxy for that, <laughs> I guess. Okay, there's nothing here. I saw on the photo that, can you ride the, the way, no. I saw somewhere a photo of Abzu and where they were riding the mantas and can you ride them? I mean, you shouldn't do that, all right? Don't do that. I will, I, I know I already said that and I'm going to keep on saying that. Don't ride animals underwater. Don't touch anything underwater. Unless it's like a life-saving situation, obviously, or for research purposes, if you think the benefit of touching the animal is higher than not touching it. But otherwise, don't touch animals just because you feel like it underwater, especially. You don't know how much harm you might be doing to it. I love, I love. I love sunfish. This is a sunfish. These guys are, they can get so big. I once feed, feed fed, blah, 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 English. I once fed a, um, a sunfish in the Lis in aquarium Lisbon. He was so cute. It was like I was feeding him some sort of jello. Oh. Okay, let's see. I'm sh so there's this door. Oh, uh, which is for my robot friend. Oh, is he here with me? I keep on losing my robot friend and I don't even realize he's gone. I'm not much of a good friend, am I? <laughs> my companion is gone and I don't even notice it. Oh, there's one right there. There's one righty, righty there. Robot friend. This time they don't even need to scan me anymore. They're just like, I know you're cool. Cause oh, octopus. No, it's not. It's just some vases, broken vases from, but it is an octopus. Oh dude, hey. Octopuses have arms, not tentacles by the way. <laughs> random facts. I'm just throwing out random facts about things I know about the animals I see. I hope you appreciate it. <laughs> oh, shut up. Okay, now let's go to those doors. That's really what I need to do. Uh, I literally saw them. It, it was where the... Where the okay, okay, I'm lost. Okay. Oh. <laughs> there. I feel so epic right now. <laughs> I feel so epic. shiny things what are these shiny things lights the stars inside the ocean <laughs> tiny stars okay Well, that's a lot of work to open the door. <gasps> manatins, no. Oh, those were manatins. Or are they dugongs? Wait, which ones have the round tail and which ones have the pointy tail? Do I have to like run now because it's gonna start closing? Do 
Do I have to like be super fast? Is that it? I am already messing this up. I'll never make it. Oh no. Oh, but there's another one. But wait, I, these are either Manitans or Dugongs. I know one, one of them has the round, roundish tail like these guys. See, they also have horizontal tails, which means they're marine mammals and not fish. And what was that right now? Yeah, but, uh, but can I ride a dugong? <laughs> but yeah, so I think these are dugongs. I think the manatees have the pointy tail, but I'll, sh I I'll let you know on the screen if I'm right or wrong. Can I, can I, excuse me, may I? <gasps> yeah! Manatee, okay, I got it wrong. So these are manatees, the ones that have the pointy tail, more like, you know, the tail of a dolphin. They are dugongs. They are, they are herbivores, very sweet animals, and it is thought that they were the origin for the myth of mermaids. Probably throughout the ancient years, ancient or not so ancient years, but in the past, sailors would see dugongs and manatees and because of their appearance, they would think they were mermaids. So that's where a lot of people think mermaids came from, or the, the myth of mermaids came from. Oh, can I open the other door through here? No, but there's another of these ammonites. What can I do with these? I unlock some <gasps> Nautilus. Do you see these? These are Nautilus. They are a living fossil. That's what we call them because they are one of the most ancient animals to still exist. Hence, we call them living fossils because they have survived so an ex extinction period. <laughs> Sorry. And they are super ancient. I'll, I'll, tell, I'll write it here on the screen how ancient they are. Okay, but uh, I know I have to open the other side of the door. So here, in, probably there. There's another. But here there is, wait a second. Uh, here, okay, here's the other. Current? Oh, there it is. There it is. Current? Current? That, that's not how you... Chain. Sorry for more por my Portuguese English sometimes. We call corrente in Portuguese for a chain. So <laughs> I sometimes just say words in English that sound like the Portuguese ones, but they just me have a completely different meaning. And I just realized afterwards. That was a, an example of that. But just look at this marine life. Yo. <laughs> That's just amazing. Do I need to be fast now? I don't know, but I'm going to be fast because I want to see what's coming next. <laughs> Mr. Abzu. Oh, and by the way, some of you were talking to me about the legend of Abzu and if I knew about it and actually I didn't but I went to read it and it's from a uh, Abzu was like an entity of the freshwater there was like a sort of a oh it's the music is getting more intense a sort of he's drinking coffee I oh, know he has a vase on his <laughs> it really looked like he was just like sipping a cup of tea a cup sipping a cup of tea or a coffee, I don't know what I'm saying. And I cannot do accents, I don't know why I try. But anyways, um, yeah, and Samar was it a Sumerian god? No, I can't remember where it was. 
I read it when I when I I, I actually didn't memorize the the myth, but it's very interesting. You should check it out. So Abzu was a sort of a god from the freshwater entity, and then there was like he mixed with the salt water and I'm sorry, white shark. Oh, are you gonna eat me? No, you ain't. Oh, I cannot go back. But, yo, I do think he's a deity. Deity, I don't know how to say that word. I think that shark might be a sort of like a, no, only some sharks you can, some sort of like a something. <laughs> A guide from beyond, a god, something. I don't know. Maybe I'm totally wrong. <laughs> but he keeps appearing like suspiciously and disappearing suspiciously whenever I'm around. Anyways, read The Legend of Abzu. It's very interesting. The legends of the past. Mm. Oh, I'm back to the portal and I'm excited to see what comes next. Oh. <laughs> now we're going to the meditation zone which I love. I love this part, this part. <coughs> <coughs> Wrong pipe. Oh, these are phantom nautilus. What is the next animal? What is the next animal? I'm so excited. Because every time we share our heart with this beauty, we do this, there's a new animal jumping out of this tower. <gasps> no whale sharks, whale sharks, whale sharks. <sighs> no, guys. <sighs> whale sharks are sharks, so they are fish, not whales. They are called whale sharks because they resemble whales in some some ways and they don't have teeth but whales have teeth so that's not that was a dumb thing whales have teeth but whale sharks don't they are filter feeders which means they have this open mouth without teeth that you just open and they swim and they eat whatever comes in into their mouth basically they filter it out of the water mm. go to the sharkies it's the biggest fish in the world <laughs> again don't do this in real life I will say this all the time I don't want to promote this sort of thing <laughs> But in the game is okay. In the game you can definitely do it because it's awesome. Oh. Okay. Just. I'm still amazed by the colors of this game. I'm in a sauna. Oh, a Turkish bath or something. A Turkish bath underwater. <laughs> tiles. In my home country of Portugal, tiles are a big thing. 
We are quite big on tiles. We do a lot of things with tiles. Oh, I'm so curious. I would love to know what this means. So, my ancestors are collecting water from this river. They have that thing over their head, which is water. I think the idea is that water is like a diet, uh, like something important. And then they go and they throw water. Where do they throw water? Is there something down here that might interest me? No. Oh, they throw water down. And then there are stars underwater and the portal and the universe. I'm making this up, I have no idea. <laughs> oh. oh! That's so cute, it's the robot. Oh. I think it was the robot. Okay. 29 minutes already. Oh, we're gonna have to stop at some point. Okay. I don't wanna stop. I don't wanna stop, but I think we have to because it's been going on for a while now. Time just flies. Time just flies. I didn't even... And all the way there 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 I do think the shark is like a mystical ancient being that is just checking out for me I do think so I'm so excited I I'm just speculating and maybe there's really the goal of the game is like just exploring there's actually no story behind anything but it's fine I'll make my own story check if it's not turned off. Should I stop here now? <sighs> I don't wanna, but I should. No, I'm not. I'm gonna go one more. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. We're up in the open ocean again. So there is a pattern. I already. In, oh no, we're not in the open ocean. Never mind. Forget what I was saying. These crinoids here, they're actually animals. These things that look like flowers. They're not flowers, they're not plants, they're animals. <gasps> A blue whale, no way. Hi. Oh my gosh. I 
I cannot even imagine if this were real. Like, I... Can you imagine an animal this size swimming next to you? It's both... Please stop. <laughs> stop showing me so many beautiful things. I'm just, I'm not doing anything. I'm not swimming. <gasps> I just had to take a screenshot of that. <gasps> This is magical. I'm having a magical moment. I'm definitely doing that again. Oh, wow. I don't know. I don't just don't know what to say. This doesn't look so lively as before. Hydrothermal vents. <gasps> hydrothermal vents, hydrothermal vents. This is definitely more deep ocean. What is the... Wait, 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 what? <laughs> okay, triangles, bad. Triangles, bad. We don't want triangles. What was that? What the f... What do you want, triangle? Jesus. I need to meditate. <laughs> I need to chill. <laughs> Flabby whale fish. Oh, yeah, I am in the deep. These are deep sea fish. I was just <laughs> not expecting that shock. I'm shocked with the shock. Ooh, viper fish. With their bioluminescent thingies, like lanterns on the top of their head. That they used to attract prey, actually. Because of the deep, when there's usually some sort of light because there is no light in the deep water. You always have some fish that are attracted to it and will try to, because they think it might be some sort of prey, they will try to catch it and then these other fish will take advantage of it. I love deep sea. The deep sea is so mysterious. Oh, I've seen you. <laughs> Damn, this is brutal down here. Wow, <laughs> there's a slight s s change of tone right now. Humboldt squid, these squids are, can, can attain like ginormous sizes. I think it's one of the largest, it's not the largest squid there is, but it's one of the largest squids there, is, there are. Okay, I think I've seen almost all the fish that were here, no? I can leave. Okay, I think this is a good time to end this because I do see that there will be a change of, <gasps> that's a ship. Is it a ship? Oh no, it's a blue whale skeleton. Oh. Oh, okay, but I think I'm gonna end here. There's definitely been a change in tone of the game right now and I suspect it's going to continue changing and I'm super excited to see what comes next because seems like there's going to be some changes.
Cool. No, 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 no so mystical giant triangle. Don't you dare. Okay. That's it. That's it. We are going to stop here. Whew. I'm excited. I really want to continue playing. This was it. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you want to watch the previous one, I will leave it down in the description and in one of the cards somewhere here. If you want to watch more ocean related slash marine biology related content, don't forget to subscribe down here. You know, the belly bell ring thing in case you want to have notifications whenever I upload a video. Apparently that's a thing. And yeah, I do hope you are all doing fine and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.